Let's find out if you need to plug in your Galaxy S22 Ultra when factory, factory resetting your device. I have heard the biggest complaint on my YouTube channel is people saying, hey, it doesn't work. The factory reset that you provide doesn't work. And I've heard in some of the discussions and some message boards that Android 14 makes you now plug in your device to a computer and just to make the connection in order for the factory reset uh, buttons to work. So let me confirm on this S22 Ultra software. We have Android 14. So let's let's see what happens if we try to factory reset this device. All right, so let's power this off and the newer phones, I think it's volume down and power and you hold them and we get a power off. All right, let's power this device off. Now in almost all new Samsung Galaxy devices, uh, the factory reset is volume up and power. So let's do that. And I always say to hold the volume up a split second faster than power, like this, volume power. Okay, and we'll let go when we see the logo. And now most people say it just law it it cycles back on it just powers on, but I yeah there we go see you don't that's frustrating I hope that uh, this helps you out uh, this will go through the let's see wipe data factory reset it allows me to cho choose it I'm not going to reset the phone right now but at least it goes through actually you know what I'm going to to make sure that it does factory data reset I'm going to push OK. Let's see down here. Yeah, the data wipe is complete. Safe to reboot the system. So that proves you do not need, obviously, to connect to anything, your Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra, in order to factory reset it. If this has helped you, please like, please subscribe, and thank you for watching.